There's been a lot of miscommunication around the closing of a south pond at Reed Park. That pond was drained and now community members are speaking out online. They say a structure will be built on top of it. News 4 Tucson's Austin Walker joining us live to get to the bottom of this. Austin. Tucsonans hold Reed Park very closely. Three years ago, the city allowed the zoo to acquire the park, excuse me, to acquire the pond, and that has caused a lot of controversy. So as soon as the fence went up and the pond was emptied, there's been mixed reactions. Rodney Lowell and his wife Kathleen are longtime Tucsonans. They walk around Reed Park, including the South Pond, pretty often, reminiscing on old times. I just remember how my kids enjoyed watching the ducks and the turtles and watching them, the new types of birds. When they heard about the closure of the South Pond, they had mixed feelings. And so I'd hate for the next generation or two generations later, kids, uh, if they don't get to enjoy it. This project has been three years in the making. Yes, we're excited. Nancy Kluge, the president of the Reed Zoo, says they plan to expand the zoo using the South Pond to further the tiger habitat. This will give them about uh, five times more room than they've had before. A petition was launched against the expansion, saying, quote, in part, destruction of the South Pond will displace many animals. The zoo says the animals will still have access to the pond because it's an outdoor habitat. But don't worry, the North Pond and Giant Waterfall are staying. Will continue to be completely accessible to the public. And while the South Pond won't be the same as years before, Rodney and Kathleen are finding the positives. It sounds like uh, they'll have more to see in a way. Making Maybe. more memories at the South Pond but this time maybe making their way inside the Reed Park Zoo to do so. Councilman Kazachik said that the pond is not filled right now because they are checking the soil to see if it is okay for the next part of the process. Now, if you feel strongly about this and want to make your voice heard, the next council meeting will be on the 17th of this month. We've got you covered from Reed Park. I'm Austin Walker. News for Tucson.